So I am watching a movie called Ladybugs with Jonathan Brandis, R.P. Jonathan Brandis, hottie, hottie, hottie in this movie, who dresses up like a girl, just like in those other movies, um, just like, just one of the guys, and the other one with, um, uh, Corey Hames, where he dresses up as a girl, so just one of the girls, and then there's just one of the guys. This is kind of like just one of the guys where he dresses up as a girl to play girls soccer and then just like one of the girls with Corey Haynes, that one, he dresses up like a girl to hide from these bullies and get on the chilling squad and help this girl out. So yeah, good movie. So if you like those two movies, you'd like this one called Ladybugs. The mother in this movie, she is the mother in Mr. Bub Mr. Bevadio. So if you like Mr. Bevadio, you would like this. You would like her in this movie. See, there she is. So that's my review for Ladybugs, and that is what I'm watching on Tuesday, April 28th, 2020, for the quarantine, being stuck at home movies that I'm watching this week. TV shows I watched today, you know, the same old General Hospital. No need to talk about that unless you want to know my thoughts on the show. And later tonight I'll be watching, um, at 7 o'clock I'll be watching Teen Mom, oh, Teen Mom with Amber and Caitlin and them. And then at 8 o'clock I'll be watching on TLC. Little People Big World, then I will be watching Seven Little Johnsons, and then I have on TiVo, um, The Connors. So if you want me to review those shows for tonight, let me know in the comments down below, and I will do that. Or I might just do it and see what you think, and if you like it, let me know in the comments down below. But, uh, that's what I'm doing for today, yesterday, on Monday. I already made a video talking about wanting to do this, and I didn't really watch any movies besides the one I talked about. And then my camera battery died, so, yeah. I just got done watching Team Mom. I feel very sorry and bad for Mackenzie losing her mom like that, because I lost my mom, my grandmother to cancer, and I also lost my dad not to cancer, but... But, uh, anyways, now we're gonna watch Little People, Big World, Teen nice Mom, was just okay. sad yeah, at the end, and Amber's moving way too fast, meeting another guy when she needs to be single, take it slow, and this guy's from France, like, what the fuck? Okay, just missed the funniest thing with, uh, with the boy, um, god dang it. What's his name? Not, uh, Mark. He, uh, he got asked, Are you still gay? And he goes, All day, every day. So I'm watching the Connors. I just got done watching Samuel Johnson, so they went camping. And had no phones for the weekend because they're getting a new kitchen and a new floor. So that's pretty cool. You know what's making me sick? Is they're making all these reboots. But we can't see them on TV unless we have Peacock. Or one of the services online that is getting on my last nerves they put fuller house on netflix they were going to do lizzie mcguire but then something happened and now they canceled it then they're doing save of the bell god knows what channel that's gonna what not channel but what site that's gonna be on and you have to pay for these sites to see them it's kind of annoying if you're gonna do a reboot Show it on fucking TV. If you're not gonna fucking show it on TV, then don't do the fucking reboot. That's so annoying. They're doing a Punky Booster reboot, and it's gonna be on Peacock. Like, what the fuck? So today, for April 30th, 2020, I am watching, right this minute, right now, but today, I didn't watch anything but the same old shit I always watch every day, which is Celebrity Page, 
Inside Edition, Entertainment Tonight, Excess Hollywood, um, X Extra, The List, People's Courts, you know, stuff like that. Um, I was trying to watch the ones I had last night, all day today. I did record Dirty Dancing, so I might be watching that sometime this week with some Hey Dude, I don't know. I mean, uh, I want to try and get these videos out every Friday, but then, and then if I watch anything over the weekend, let you guys know, and then, so we'll basically start on Saturday, Sunday, and then go from Saturday to Friday, and then Friday night, post it, which on Friday nights I usually watch Mama June, so... Not to Hot, uh, Family Edition, and that one's been going crazy with Mama, with, uh, Honey Boo Boo and, and, and her mom and stuff like that, and, you know, I do like the, um, General Hospital flashbacks, so I'll probably show you the flashback, which flashback episode that is for General Hospital, for all you General Hospital fans. But yeah, I didn't watch too much this week of movies. I did watch, which I should have recorded. I didn't think of it last night. Of, of just one of the guys. Because I saw a reunion thing from 2015 on YouTube. And so I just had to watch that show, that movie again. With the, you know, the guy from Karate Kid. And so that was pretty good. And then I watched. Right after that, I was I found out that when I was looking at um, I think it was Wet Movie. No, it was Cool. Maybe it was Cool Dodo's channel. No, it was Wet Movie One's channel. Brandon, when he was going through his boxes of what to keep and what not to keep, what to give away and stuff, what to put on his eBay, and he had the Police Academy. And and I found out that there was a box set for seven movies. And I was like, there's seven movies of Police Academy? I only have the box set for one through four. I didn't really like five. I tried watching six last night, but I fell asleep in the middle of it, so I'm going to have to finish that. And then I think they have seven. So I'm going to check that out. It's on a free website. That's why I'm checking it out at. And then that will be it for my movies. So if you want me to do a review or tell you what I think about 6 and 7 of Police Academy, let me know in the comments down below and I'll do so. Um, but other than that, I'll try and get these out on Fridays, but I don't know if I can, but I will try. Okay? Till then, later haters. So today's flashback starts out with Scott Baldwin at his house saying, this episode's about me, da 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 da, but it's not about him, so I don't know why they used him. But, this is the episode when AJ dies and goes to heaven after Sonny shot him. And Emily comes to take him to heaven with Lila and Edward. And this is also when Sonny has flashbacks with all the different Carly's about his life with Carly. So it's a flashback with a flashback. I wish they would quit playing these kind of flashbacks from 2018, 2019, and 2017. Like, do the, do the 90s. Come on, those are the ones we want to see. But, uh, it's also about Lucy trying to pick, does she want Scott Baldwin, or does she want Kevin? And, you know how that ends. Bobby's in there, and, as you can see, Monica. So, you know, that's what this general hospital is about, and that's the flashback for this week. Hope you enjoyed watching this video of what I watched all week long, um, tonight, 
my mom doesn't get home until about almost 3 a.m. And, and if I'm still up, I'll watch Mama June with her. If not, we'll watch this weekend. And my head really, really hurts right now. And I gotta wake her up early so I can't really fall asleep and get rid of it. So I am using this wash, wet washcloth on my head. Don't know if you can see that. And yeah. That's all I gotta say for this week. That's all I'm gonna be watching this week. When General Hospital was over with. I'll just be watching the same old, same old. And later haters.